Welcome to the first Twisted League video. If you don't know what Twisted League is, it is basically a Zeo locked Iron Man. But there is a big twist, because everyone gets a 5x XP multiplier and the goal of the league is to complete tasks. With these tasks, you'll earn points, which you can unlock relics with. These relics can be used to boost your XP even more. My goal for Twisted League is to get the first Monster Clue completion. Pog Champion. We're in Twisted League. Let's fucking get it. All right, we gotta be, we can never change our look again, so we have to look smooth. There we go, I'm looking absolutely suave. Um, everyone's already running. I'm trying to find men. Guys, I need to know, where are these men? Because I want to go pickpocketing instantly. Oh shit, relics. Um, I'm taking the prayer one because I'm going the slayer way, and uh, that seems best for me. Otherwise, look at that. Beautiful. I think we can start now. Okay. Everyone's just standing here right now. I have 6 HP. This is probably not gonna end well. I'm already 5 thieving. Let's get it. All right, running to Hosidius for the fruit stalls. We're 25 thieving. That's all we've got so far. Uh, we have been 12 minutes into the game, which is actually a lot for what we've done so far. But fruit stalls and then gonna kill some cows. Probably gonna start Slayer very soon. We'll see what we do. Maybe I'll just rush 63 thieving, start doing stone chests and go for the Xerix talisman all in one. Um, it's all a bit top of the dome. And I don't know this whole area that well. So, it's pick and play at this point. Just trying not to waste too much XP. Alright, apparently for the fruit stalls you need favor. I didn't know that. Thing is, I'll be fine, but I'm just gonna chop some wood till I see a free plow. And I'm just gonna run towards it and take it. That's the plan for now. Meanwhile, we can work on our requirements for winter tot. The plan has not failed yet, okay? Just chopping a little bit of wood. And then when we see a free plow, we're running. We're bolting towards it. Here we go, we're up to Oaks now. Still watching the bots in the distance. <laughs> Trying to find a free plow so I can start plowing. I think it's actually already overrated. I might as well do silk stalls at this point, but I have to do this woodcutting grind anyway, so we'll see what we do about that. Maybe I don't even need the favor at this point. I'm training combat now, boys. It's happening. Let's get that slayer grind going. <laughs> I'm going from starting the woodcut to farming to slaying again. <laughs> We're just doing whatever I want to do. The plan was to do Slayer and I should stick to the plan and not start woodcutting all over the place. Someone already got Rocky. First bet probably in the league. Congrats to whoever the, sh the fuck that is. <laughs> Holy shit. First bet in the league probably with this guy. He's probably got like 30 thieving. Could have been me. Could have been me. All right, we've come up with a little plan. I'm gonna bank all my cakes and stuff, and I'm just gonna thieve a shit ton of silk. After like 30 minutes, I can sell that silk back to the guy and maybe make my money that way. Even in uh, the Twisted League, I suck at keeping my levels. But this is the level for Monster Farmer, so we're going to go there soon. That's why I've been training thieving for the past, like, half an hour. The plan now is to train some combat, get a Slayer task, go to Konar, do my home teleport back, hopefully get a cow slayer task or a sand crab slayer task, something like that. So we have enough hit points to efficiently do these monster farmers. That is the plan. This, by the way, is going to be the shop that I'll be using. It sells scimitars and armor. This is actually a beast. A beast of a shop. Yes, yes, yes. What's the first? What was it? I didn't even read it. Sand crabs. Yes, let's get it. So they just released the tiers of relics, and on the fourth tier, I'll put it on the screen, is Treasure Seeker. Creatures which drop clue scrolls now have a 1 out of 10 rate. Always. Clues, jodes, nests, clue bottles are now found 10 times more often. All unstarted clues are stackable, and have the lowest number of steps for their tier. I am sold. I am in love. This is insane. I'm rushing through that relic right now. Twenty percent. I am absolutely out. Not coming back. Now I'm gonna get myself a mithril scimitar and let's get this going. Oh my god! I just got an orgasm. Yes, please. All right, that's the buys we're doing. Steel scimitar, mithril scimitar, the anti dragon shield, and iron plate legs. I'll take it. We're about to get um twenty attack, so we can wear our mithril scimitars. Finally, start getting some defense and strength levels. We're struggling. We're struggling, but it's slowly, slowly getting solved. We might actually get our very first Slayer. XP here. If he respawns on this one HP, I'm gonna be triggered. There he is. 300 XP for Slayer. Let's get it. All right, quick update. We are 26 attack, 24 defense, 20, uh, 24 strength and 20 defense. Currently also gaining up the Slayer levels because I'm getting 300 XP every kill, which is pretty good. I'm kind of AFKing, kind of talking to the chat on stream right now. Total level is also coming in right now, so pretty proud. It's going pretty well. Got an extra iron pickaxe. We're sailing. 
Hopefully I don't get a shit slayer task after this one. OT Locust from the clan chat just got Ankaus, and we are not even close to being able to do that. And there's the first random event of the whole league after two hours almost, the second best one. I have no idea where to use this on, uh, or what to use this on yet. So we'll keep hold of it for a little bit, but that is very sick. Quick detour, we're done with the very first Slayer task. I got 36, 36, 30 now, and 30 Slayer. I'm actually rank about 4 Slayer at this point. And before I go back to Konar, because I'm here anyways, I'm going to quickly get 20 fishing by fishing shrimp and anchovies. Uh, and then get another task out of the way. And after that, hopefully we can get a good task from Konar. If we can, then I'm going to keep doing Slayer and try and go for rank 1. If I get a very shit task, I'm probably going to the Hill Giants to try and get 43 prayer with the big bones. That's 20 fishing, easy. Uh, I've got some some shrimps banked, so we I think we might actually be able to get 22 cooking or something like that. Why am I trying to shop, shop a you? Shop, shop. I wanted to get two logs for a fire, so that's one. Might as well get that level, why not? Quickly get that 22. How am I 22 woodcutting already? I need another ax though. We are actually going to get 23 cooking, so it was not far off. Not bad, 334 total now. I don't know what we're going to finish on. But let's get back to Konar and hope we get a decent Slayer task. Oof. 135 Banshees. Yikes. First things first, buy earmuffs and then think about if I'm going to do that or not. Um. Alright, we're doing decent at this point. I'm almost dead to a hill giant. I am rank 12. On the high scores so far, so not too bad. I know a lot of people haven't logged before, so I'm probably not 12th, but it's going all right. We are a bit stuck with the Slayer grind right now. Thing is, I am training prayer at this point, uh, just so I can try and do these Twisted Banshees while flicking them. I think that's the best plan. So, 43 prayer is the next goal. So, first room crafting level. There it is. Never mind. That's awkward. Now then, is the very first room crafting level. 20 XP, and now suddenly, boom, 40. Double it up. Double it up. Easy room crafting XP. And the last room crafting XP is coming in, because this is 100% Arceus favor. I know we kind of took a little loop around <laughs> with, um, with, all, with all the plans now. We're just going to cash in all our books and all our scrolls that we still can. I uh, don't have any dark manuscripts anymore, so let's see what room crafting we are able to get. As long as these guys keep giving me the books, I'll keep running around. All right, Sam, come on. Ah, uh, there we go. That's where it ends. Drop in the books and see what room crafting level we get. Boom, I think we might hit 25. Just about not. Got 24. I'll take it. Our friend Samposh from the CC tells me that he's almost done plowing, so I can actually get some Hosidius favor finally. Uh, quickly gonna pick up a hammer here and then start plowing the field. There he is, my boy. My boy, bro, Samuli. You know, can I actually buy make a fire? Yo, no XP waste. And it's mine now. It is mine now. Oh, don't you dare! Oh, he's gonna steal it. This little shit, mate. Hello? Is he gonna be kind? Let's see. Let's see about the community. All right, and at the end of the day, we are ready to go to Winter Todd. That is 50 fire making. The last thing I'm going to be doing today is one Winter Todd run. See if I can get lucky. Close it off with these stats. Um, let me re-log and show you guys what rank we ended up on. Uh, I wasted a lot of time wood cutting and fire making at the end. Probably not going to be rank 12 or anything anymore, but we'll see. We ended up being rank 19. Not too bad. I'm thinking we're going to drop back all the way to 500 tomorrow. Because I'm catching a very early night. And then we'll see if we can get back up. And then I went to bed at 6 p.m. And woke back up at 11. So I thought, why not continue a little bit? Bit of a weird tactic right now. Winter Todd is absolute trash because I trained combat. That was a big mistake on my part. Little evaluation. I started very strong, but I should have continued with combat. I was probably one of the first people with a Mithril Scimitar, and I just got caught up in getting total levels. Bit of a wasted first day. The start was incredible, but later towards the end... I kind of ruined it. So, we're getting straight back into it on day 2, and I started the Clan of Current quest. I should have started that all the way at the beginning, because that way I can just walk around Zaya and complete it passively. That's what I'm doing now. Because I'm passing the Cable Slowlines right now anyways, I'm gonna quickly get myself 12 hunting. After that, I'm going back up, trying to complete Clan of Karend, and go back to the Hill Giants. I am, like the plan was, going back to combat. Get my prayer up to 43, and start slaying these banshees, while also passively doing all the tasks I need to do, like Clan of Karend, and after that, Ascend of Arceus. That'll eventually get my hunting up, 
to 26, and then I just have 9 more levels to train till I can do aerial fishing. The plan is still to get the first monster clue completion, so I gotta get my focus right and get back on that combat. Get back on those clues, because we haven't done any yet. Let's get it. Going for a fire staff, I don't even care. I'm gonna wait for it. Might be very big time waste. Hoping to get one within the minute. Oh, got it. Fuck yes. And that is 40 hit points, and we're also really, really close to 40 defense. Oh shit, I didn't even see the cosmic runes. That's actually really good. So, with these two levels, um, I will be able to get my second relic. Alright, there we go. That should be the new relic. So let's go to relics. Um, and a natural selection is when receiving a Slayer Tosk and Farming Contracts, you can now choose what you are uh, assigned. I'm going to take this one, because as I just told you guys, um, we are focusing on the clue, and that is going to be massive. Now, this one is insane. Three times the normal amount of resources for mining, fishing. So if you cut one tree, you get three logs. For Winter Taunt, that is absolutely overpowered as shit. It is hands down the best relic, but as I said, I'm going for one thing and one thing only. And we'll see if we max after that. Probably not. 